Meet Doug Reese, photographer extraordinaire. Doug, give us a tip on taking pictures of wildflowers. Well, actually, I buy a John Felder calendar. But if you want to take some pictures on your own, Butler Gulch is a wonderful place to do so, particularly at the end of June, early July. It's one of the most prolific locations for wildflowers, lots of different varieties. Unfortunately, there's a lot of wind here, and that moves the flowers around. So typically, you'll need to use a very large aperture. That would be a low number f-stop, so that your shutter speed is higher. You also may need to use a higher ISO also to boost up your shutter speed. And then, if you're using a small point-and-shoot like this, you'll probably put it on macro mode, or you'll use a macro lens on a DSLR. Anyway, I hope someday you'll have a chance to come to Butler Gulch and photograph these magnificent Colorado wildflowers. Here we have Doug the photographer again. Doug, give us a tip, another one, on photography of wildflowers. Okay, Janet, uh, last time we spoke about shutter speed and, because, and taking pictures of wildflowers. Often it's windy in Colorado and you need a higher shutter speed, which means having a large aperture. Large apertures usually give you a shallow depth of field which often is quite aesthetic when taking pictures of flowers. It gives a blurry background with the focus right on the flower. Another tip, and what's most important to photographers, of course, is light. And it's nice to take pictures early in the morning, just after sunrise, because the quality of the light. It is now about 10 a.m. The sun is higher in the sky, and as the sun gets higher in the sky in Colorado, the color of the light becomes more blue. To cut out that blueness, you may want to put your camera on shade or another setting to give add a little more yellow to the picture, which is particularly good when taking pictures of something red or yellow. This is a rather red Indian paintbrush, and putting it on shade with this blue light can bring out the reds. Have a great day and you're with your photography.